that's, and that's all, all I remember, I remember you guys. guys. Relax and breathe. I, I took a deep breath and then that was it. I knocked out. All I remember is waking up in another room with other girls, but like we were separate like by curtains. And then um, just a girl like telling me, Brenda, Brenda, come back. Um, everything went well. I'm gonna go ahead and call your husband. And I'm like, I can't breathe. I couldn't breathe. So then I I knocked out again. And then um, they woke me, when they woke me up, they put, um, uh, ay, como se llama? The air through the oxygen through the nose. And then um, I'm there like, toda, like drug and like, I couldn't even stay awake, right? So I can hear that she's calling my husband and she's telling him that everything went well, that you could come already to see her and whatever, right? And that's it. I fall back asleep and I honestly wanted to like film all this for you guys, but I don't know. I was so nervous, you guys, that I I took the camera and everything with me because I wanted to record, but I, I don't know. I forgot about it. And then after the two days at the hospital that I was there, I know you guys, it was painful. So I never thought about getting the camera or even like taking a picture. Nada, you guys. Nada, nada. And then um, I wake up and my husband is there and he's like, oh, how are you doing? Whatever. And then they're like okay well now that your husband is here we're gonna go ahead and take you for a walk and i'm like what a walk girl and then she's like uh, so take your time whatever you have to go to the bathroom and so and so so then here we go we're going for a walk and i keep telling them i feel dizzy i feel dizzy but i'm gonna go ahead and walk for you but i feel dizzy so here i am walking and then um i didn't even do the whole lap you guys because i was so dizzy so she took me through the half of lap and when we turn i kid you not everything spin like everything and i told my husband i'm gonna fall i feel so dizzy so then the nurse that was helping me she's like oh no 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 no, hold on hold her and i don't know it was so fast they gave me a chair they sat me down and then like they took me back to the room and then i fell back asleep <laughs> so i was supposed to be out that same day i think it was no that they be that the next day in the morning but i had to reach a goal of drinking 20 little cups of water so it's they're like medicine cups and i had to drink 20 of them and i'm like there's no fucking way i'm gonna drink 20 little cups like use girl when i tell you that i could drink a freaking shot like nothing i could take but when when it was time to drink those little mini uh, medicine cups of water i couldn't do it all right you guys so i have all this stuff um that i've got last year some of it is from michael's some of it is from dollar tree and some my sister gave me so then here comes the second day and i'm supposed to be discharged from the hospital that day but then your girl here doesn't drink those 20 little damn cups of water so then i have to spend two motherfucking days at the hospital so i'm there at the hospital by myself because my husband had to leave at eight so i'm there by myself and i'm like thinking and thinking i'm like oh my god i can't believe i did the surgery and this and that right <sighs> you know this me but i was so thankful to god that i opened my eyes back as soon as surgery was done te lo juro i like promise you that i was praying to god that night my first night I was like oh my god Dios mío gracias por dejarme abrir los ojos de nuevo para ver mis hijos regresar a mi casa con bien and all of that guys because I swear to you that my worst fear was being put to sleep I don't know why I wasn't I wasn't like scared about the surgery I was scared more about like going putting being being put to sleep that's what that was my like my fear throughout the whole time but honestly I don't regret it I'm happy I went through it I didn't chicken out <laughs> I'm doing good right now um the only only complication I had the first day was the water intake but now I'm doing better I drink a lot of water I hardly get hungry but the 
girl the first week oh my god i was starving i was so hungry i told my best friend friend i don't know about you but when as soon as i got out of the hospital i swear to you i wanted to fucking eat so bad but she didn't have to do the the diet before going into surgery so she wasn't starving like i was you know yes the my incisions are doing good i went and saw my surgeon she said everything looked good i haven't even told you what kind of surgery i have what a dumbass <laughs> so the type of surgery that i got was telescopic something gastric bypass surgery at the end of the day my stomach is as small as an egg so nothing much fits so si tomo agua like i don't get hungry because my stomach is full of water so i'm supposed to drink 30 minutes before i eat so that way i can eat my protein and not be full of water but with protein uh that's the surgery that i got and um i don't regret it right now so far i've officially lost 31 pounds and i cannot be more excited <laughs> but yes you guys that's what's been going on in my life let me show you how all this looks so that i can close the video all right you guys so i'm gonna show you the final look so here we go this is how it looks the second shelf and then the final shelf I ended up putting the um, the candle inside there and don't these marshmallows look so freaking cute Oh my god, so cute. So. So yes, you guys. This is how my coffee station looks now. And I am loving it. So that is it you guys that's what has been going on in my life it's been a big change it's been two weeks since my surgery and oh my god when i tell you i get full with three spoonfuls i get full with three spoonfuls <laughs> but yes you guys this is the video this is what has what's been going on um if you guys have any questions go ahead and put them down in the comments down below for sure comment down below so that way i know that you stop by so i love you guys i miss you so 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 much much and as always it's your girl B and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye! Pray that I